Hey Rachel, oh, nice yeah. to see you again. How are you? Yeah, I'm great, yeah. Good, good. Guys, this is my mate, Chris Blue. Hi everyone. Hi Chris. Hi. But I just should correct you a second, Rachel. Oh, okay. I'm not Chris Blue today. I'm Chris Purple. That's the craziest suit I've ever seen. <laughs> We've come into Chalfont today to meet a few of our friends to talk about Purple Day and epilepsy. Because purple is the internationally recognised colour for epilepsy. So I've told you what I'm doing dressed like this today. But tell me, do any of you have any experience of epilepsy? No. Uh, no. no. Perhaps no. you can tell us more. <laughs> There's always one, isn't there? <laughs> I didn't know you said what comes to mind. <laughs> so, pause for yeah. clipping them. But I'm going to ask you another question, which I want you to answer. Okay. But you do a lot of work for us down here at uh, the Epilepsy Society. So tell us a bit about the work you do for us. We've been working with Carl and Katrina, uh, dealing with a lot of the artwork to do with um, Purple Day. Um, we've been printing the bunting, the stickers that are going out, some of the folders as well. Uh, it's been really interesting, but as I said, we don't really know much about epilepsy, uh, epilepsy as a whole. So let me tell you just a tiny bit about it. So epilepsy affects around 1% of the population around the world. So in the UK, that's around 600,000 people that are affected by epilepsy. So the chances are you may know someone or have a friend or even a relative perhaps that is affected by epilepsy. So we're trying to create more awareness and understanding of people towards epilepsy. And there's lots of challenges we face in doing that. Communication is one, which is why we rely so heavily on the, the great artwork that you guys help us with, because it helps promote epilepsy, helps promote the colour, it gets people talking, that's why we're wearing this sort of suit today. Mm -hmm. So that's just giving you a little feel for, for what epilepsy is. What we do at the Society is a number of things. We've got a care home, which looks after just around 100 people um, that are affected by epilepsy, and it's their home, they live with us. We've got a, a very um, advanced medical research centre, which looks at all sorts of exciting opportunities to improve the, the life of those with epilepsy, particularly um, embarking now on a new program around genetic research, which is very exciting. We're, we're just at the start of that journey. And then we provide information and help to all of those people around the country that are affected, that need our support and guidance. And again, that's where you can come in with all of the material and merchandise you produce that helps people better understand epilepsy. Well, it's lovely to see you all again. Yeah. Take care, guys. See you later. Bye. Bye, Chris.